one day after announcing sweeping new sanctions on Venezuela's state-owned oil company, PDVSA, the U.S. said Tuesday it's giving Venezuelan opposition leader Juan Guaido control of Venezuela's assets in the United States. Russia has condemned the U.S. action, calling the sanctions illegal interference in Venezuela's economy. Russian Foreign Minister Sergei Lavrov accused the U.S. of attempting to profit from the crisis as American companies in Venezuela are exempt from the sanctions. PDVSA subsidiary Citgo also operates across the United States. In Venezuela, the Supreme Court barred opposition leader Juan Guaido from leaving the country Tuesday and agreed to freeze his assets. Prosecutors have launched an investigation into Guaido, who last week declared himself Venezuela's interim president during a large opposition protest to President Nicolas Maduro's leadership. Meanwhile, the U.N. is calling out the violent crackdown on protests, which they say has resulted in 40 people being killed and 850 people detained, including children. Venezuelan ambassador to the United Nations, Jorge Valero, blasted the U.S.'s hypocrisy on Tuesday. What do you want the This government that suscrito por varios países europeos, que desata una guerra comercial contra China, que amenaza a Rusia con una guerra atómica, que ataca en forma indiscriminada y en forma sádica a los migrantes centroamericanos que llegan allí, que construye un muro, un muro criminal, que secuestra niños para hacer, hacerlos padecer, hijos de migrantes. Es este gobierno, el gobierno de Estados Unidos, tiene autoridad moral para imponer un dictador en Venezuela. In Washington, D.C., Democratic lawmakers are hitting back at National Security Advisor John Bolton after he was photographed holding a notepad with the words written, 5,000 troops to Colombia. Democratic Congress member Gregory Meeks posted, tweeted a photo of a yellow notepad on his desk with the handwritten words, President Trump does not have the authority to invade Venezuela. The photo caption reads, since we're sending cables by legal pad now, yellow padding, hashtag, 